Tequini, where Amazulu this afternoon hosts Kaiser Chiefs in a DSTV Premiership fixture of massive significance to both these uh, seasons. Amazulu last season, Kaiser Chiefs two seasons ago as they narrowly missed out. Tall players have gathered forward. Deep delivery here. Keeper has come, called, and this time being fouled. I was expecting that uh, an attempt to the near post because Akpay was set up looking to go for a post and uh, just the colliding there with Tintuli. You know, goalkeepers are protected in the six yard area. Oh, Mevela, he's escaped the attention of three Chiefs players. Now, Maduna back to Mevela inside the area, could create space, gets the shot in, and again, who do you think got his head in the way to deny Amazulu? Can we get a call in the Pink Panther? I. I'm, uh, yeah, I'm just thinking uh, how many times I've already called Dube. Mbongi Nikumede gets on the end of this ball. It's a flat ball, it squeaks in, great chance! What a beautiful save from Daniel Lappe. Gets down into his left. And it fell to Koki, am I right? It, Sandy, Sandy Kumalo that uh, Dube got the initial ah, touch. Kumalo it was, and uh, yeah. what a save from... Uh, Close proximity from uh, Daniel Lepay. Nage in towards Parker, trying to get a touch on it. Another save from Billy Mortois. Looks to deny Bernard Parker. Kaiser Chiefs, they are creating the opportunities. And twice now, Billy Mortois has had to come up with something special to deny the Amagorsi. There's plenty to enjoy and appreciate in this tie. Okay, oh, missed by the cannon. Charge here! Oh, absolutely tough draw! Quality strike from Karma Biliat, that was headed in. That required something utterly extraordinary to deny Biliat from here. And Mortois pulled the proverbial rabbit out of the hat. I tell you what, the strike matched the save and miss. Hit clearance from Keegan Buchanan. The ball just running a little bit away from the, the attacking player. Oh, lovely ball in here. Clear cut chance maybe for Amazulu. They've taken the lead through Mabela. He scores early on against Kaiser Chiefs. And that has got to be a very bitter pill to swallow for Kaiser Chiefs. And Mabela scores his first of the season. And importantly, gives Amazulu a lead against the side that has utterly dominated them over the years. Was it? Uh... Oh, delivery in here. This looks l lovely for Carl Alexander, who's looking to run onto it. Nangi was up as well, but now the counter attack is on for Amazulu. Ntuli is on side. Mamela is charging forward. Ntuli back to Mamela and nearly gets two. It's Akbe with another save. Well, the goalkeepers are certainly earning their money today, while there was very little Akbe could have done. Mashiane, the delivery that's gone to nobody, but it has eventually come Chief's way. Dolly! And Mortua only just holds on to it. Veli Mortua had an utterly sensational opening half, but he's had a few juggling moments in the second. A yeah, moment of brilliance from Keegan Dolly. Just a shimmy to create space there. And a brilliant shot on target by Veli Mortua. And well positioned once again to make a, a save that was made to look easy, but not easy. I tell you what, there was a lot of venom behind that shot from Keegan Dolly. Blum bringing it down into the path of Manyama. Touches here. Mulenga wants to get it away. Appeals, desperate appeals for a handball. They are denied by the referee who wants to bring an end to this match momentarily. Stanton Fredericks. We're going to see. Uh, we're going to see a penalty here after a consultation. With Emmanuel Desani, it seems, referee Jenny Chavani as final. What transpired now? This is the flick in from. Uh... Well, his hands ball had changed direction. There might have even been a handball from Manyama and bringing that ball under control. Dolly. For his first goal in Chiefs colours, he drills it home. It's 1-1, but there's also controversy over this. It is, referee's call is final, and Dolly buries the... Uh, the result in penalty. Well, there is drama and 
tragedy.